Well, hello, all my friends in Storyland. This is Mrs. B here today, and, she, and I'm going to read you a story. But first, let's see who is out in Storyland. <gasps> I brought my magic wand. My magic wand is going to help me find out who is out in Storyland. Magic wand, magic wand. Who do we see? <gasps> oh, I see Sydney looking at me. Oh, and I see Jimmy. Oh, and there's Serenity and Kian. And there's Declan and Mina. Oh, there's Anakin and Belva. Hi, Belva. And there's Ryder. How are you, Ryder, today? And there is Brooklyn and Paisley and Ridley and Carter and Tristan and Jonathan and Silas and Joshua and Rick. Oh, there's Eden and Jalea and oh, there's out there. Oh, Oh, there's Tierra. Oh, hi, Tierra. I am so happy you visited me today. And I have a great story for you. In fact, it's informative. It's going to inform you of something. Have you ever heard of the word contractions? Here's our big word, contractions. Contractions, three syllables. We're going to learn about what contractions are. <gasps> Let's see, take a survey. How many of you have heard of contractions? <gasps> One, two, three, four, five. <gasps> five of you. Well, that's great. Well, we're, I'm going to have the story today. And the name of it is, what do you think? Contractions. If you were a contraction by Tricia Speechest, Jaskin, illustrated by Sarah Gray. Contractions have something special in them. We have to see what they are. If you were a contraction, your best friend would be the apostrophe. Can you all see that apostrophe there? You would change could not to couldn't and would not to wouldn't. There's our could not. They crossed off the O, put a contraction in, and have the could and the N apostrophe T. Would not, they do the same thing. It's exciting to, know, to learn new things. If you were a contraction, you would be made by combining two words and leaving out a letter or letters. You would use an apostrophe to take the place of the missing letter or letters. Who's, W-H-O apostrophe S, who's going to the store, Mama asks. I'm going, says Papa. I'm going, says Sister. We're all going, Brother says. Who is becomes who. I am becomes I'm. And we are becomes we're. If you were a contraction, you could add the word not to another word. Papa, don't hog the pancakes. You shouldn't overeat. Mama said, you shouldn't overeat, Mama said. Do not becomes don't. Should not becomes shouldn't. And would not becomes wouldn't. Don't worry, I wouldn't dream of it, Papa said. Papa said he's not going to overeat. He isn't going to overeat. If you were a contraction, you could add the word is to another word. Who's missing a hat, Mama asked. Who is becomes whose. Where is becomes where's. It is becomes its. I am, Sister said. Where's my hat now? It's right here, Brother said. For a contraction, you could add the word are to another word. The family enjoys the beach. They're building a sand sculpture. We're creating a piece of art, sister exclaimed. And you're all dirty, Papa said. They are becomes there. We are becomes we're. And you are becomes your. You are here, you are here. We're 
they're here, we are here. They are there. And they're over there. If you were a contraction, you could pair the pronoun I with another word. I am becomes I'm, I is a pronoun. I will becomes I'll. I would becomes I'd. I'm wearing my rubber boots so I can splash in the puddles, sister says. I'll wear my raincoat, brother says. I'd wear boot, rubber boots and a coat, Papa said. It's raining right now. If you were a contraction, you could talk about the past. You could explain what did and did not happen. The pigs hadn't cleaned the house for a long time. Had not becomes hadn't. Should have becomes should have. Would have becomes would have. Could have becomes could have. We should have remembered to take out the trash, Mama said. It would have helped with the smell, Papa said. It could have helped with the bugs too, Brother said. Can't leave that trash too long in the house. If you were a contraction, you could take place in the present. What's for dinner, Papa asked. What is becomes what's. I am becomes I'm. I'm having cookies, Brother says. I'm having popcorn, Sister says. Let's have pasta, Mama says. Everyone says, that's a great idea. Let us become let's. That is becomes that's. And they're doing it right now. If you were a contraction, you could take place in the future. Papa says he'll learn to play the trombone. Sister says she'll learn to play the trumpet. He will becomes he'll. She will becomes she'll. They will becomes they'll. Mama says she'll learn to be a singer. Oh, I can't sing. Brother says he'll learn to play the piano. They'll be one fun family band. You and the apostrophe would always shorten things up. There's our apostrophe on the on the scale that takes the height. If you were, you'd shorten things up if you were a contraction. So we're going to see how well we listened out in Storyland. I have my whiteboard with me. We're going to do some contractions. So I is a pronoun. Instead of saying Mrs. V or Sydney or Declan, we can say I, if you want them, okay? I am. So raise your hand if you know the contraction for I am. Oh, do you know it, Mina? Oh, you're right. I am. I'm is a contraction for I am. And look, we're taking out the A, put the apostrophe in, and put an M. I am and I'm is the same thing. And here is a pronoun, you. You will. Hmm, I wonder what the contraction for you will is. I see your hands up. What is the contraction for you will? Oh, you are so bright. You, you children are very smart. You, see the I stays there and the U stays there. Apostrophe is going to take out this I, L, L. That's you'll. You'll have a great time. You will. And here we have it is. Hmm, I wonder what that one is. Um, Brooklyn, do you know the contraction for it is? Oh, you are so right. Are we going to keep it, Brooklyn? Yes. 
that's going to be it. We're going to get rid of this I and put apostrophe and put an S. It is and it's is the same thing. Now we have she is. Let's see, who knows this one? Oh, Carter, do you know this one? Oh, can you say a little bit louder? Oh, you are right. She is, and you say we're gonna keep the she in there, right? What are you gonna, where are we going to get rid of? The I, we're gonna put the what? Apostrophe, and there's the S. She is? She's. I have a few more to go. Then you're going to be contraction experts. Okay, we are. We are. Hmm. Oh, Jonathan, what would the, the contraction for we are be? We're, right, we're gonna keep the we. We're gonna get rid of the A, apostrophe R, E. We are having a great time. We're having a great time. Okay, is not. Let's see. Ridley, did you have a turn? No, you did not, okay. What is the contraction for is not? Well, okay, Ridley tells us we're going to keep the is. And keep the N in there. Oh, we're going to get rid of the O, I, S, N, apostrophe, T. Is not is the same as isn't. And how about this one? He would. Okay, how about Jalea? Oh, you want to keep the E? The he? Okay, we'll keep the he. You have a hard one. So we're going to get rid of, what are we going to get rid of, Jalea? We say the O because we got rid of O's in, in that one. And we're going to get rid of the W and the U and the L. All those letters. And put apostrophe and what do you what's left Jalea? oh a d yes he would like some ice cream he'd like some ice cream our last one they have oh i see belva she's almost falling off her chair she's trying to get her turn in okay belva what are we going to keep here we'll start with they okay and we'll get rid of the A. Okay, everybody likes to get rid of those vowels. Oh, we'll get rid of the H too. They, they have ice cream. They, wait, they have a headache. They've got a headache. Okay. Well, I'm so glad everyone joined me today. And we'll do more contractions. I have another book we'll do, we'll call it part two contractions. Well, everybody, have a nice evening, and I will see you maybe tomorrow. Bye.